Talks. I'm Kayla. And I'm Mester. And today is April Fool's Day. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Face the flag. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Happy April Fool's Day. Here's the Traditions, Holidays, and Heroes Council to learn more. Hey, Rio. It's the Traditions, Holidays, and Heroes Council. Today, April 1st, is April Fool's Day. The holiday April Fool's Day dates back to 1582, where you play practical jokes and pranks on friends and family. The origin of this holiday is from France, when the Council of Trent called for a switch from the Julian calendar to the Gregorian calendar in 1563. The United States uses the Gregorian calendar. In the Julian calendar, the new year starts with the spring equinox around our April 1st. People that didn't get the news right away were confused, and so this calendar change led to a plethora of jokes and hoaxes. These jokes were known as April Fools because the Julian calendar would start their year on the Gregorian calendar's April 1st. Historians have connected April Fool's Day to festivals like Hilaria, Latin for joyful, which was celebrated around the end of March in ancient Rome. It included dressing up in costumes and playing jokes on others. There are also theories that April Fool's Day was linked to the vernal equinox, the first day of spring in the northern hemisphere. It is said that during the vernal equinox, Mother Nature would fool people with changing, unpredictable weather. Today, people pull creative pranks on friends and family. If you want to fool your friends and family with an April Fool's Day prank, just be sure to be safe and respectful of each other. That's it for today. Happy April Fool's Day. The Public Library is bringing back their pop-up library after spring break on Tuesday, April 12th. Come visit the library during lunch that day and see what new stuff they have to offer. Do you have a book that you want to read that our school library doesn't have? Request a copy and the local library will bring it with them on April 12th. No library card is needed. Talk to our librarian for more details. Today in clubs and activities, the Anime Club is meeting B5, the Fantasy Freaks are meeting in D13, and the Nintendo Club is meeting in C4. Here's this week's SEL Reflection. Hey Rio, on Monday we learned about insecurities. All kinds of people. Boys, girls, teenagers, and even adults experience shame about what they do or how they look because of a mean comment that someone else made. It's really hard not to feel insecure because you can't just choose to feel confident in yourself. For this week's reflection, I want you to find one thing that you don't like about yourself and find steps to make you like it. It might take a really long time to work towards that goal, but I'm not asking you to change yourself for other people, I'm asking you to change yourself for you. Today's character quote is, yesterday is history, tomorrow is a mystery, but today is a gift. That is why it's called a present. Master Uwe. Well, Rio, since we're skipping April altogether. What? I told you this is something. <sighs> Never mind. Anyway, that's it for this week. Now, now back, back to the studio. studio.